Your Highness, I am delighted to welcome you and Sheikh Hamosa to Windsor Castle at the start of your state visit. The state of Gutta and the United Kingdom, as well as our two families, have been in close touch with each other for a long time. I have vivid memories of my visit to Gutta in 1979, when together we opened the Doha English-speaking school. My two sons, Charles and Andrew, have come to know Gutta well, and they have described to me how impressed they are by the massive developments taking place throughout the state. These have been made possible by the far-sighted development of your energy resources. I'm delighted that so many British companies have been involved in this enterprise, some of whom are represented here this evening. In May last year, when we jointly inaugurated the South Hook gas import terminal in Wales, we saw at first hand how this development has benefited the people of both our countries. Social and economic progress need a well-educated population. I know that Her Highness is determined to ensure that future generations of your citizens have the skills they need to succeed. Over the last 40 years, we have welcomed many young Qataris to study in this country, and we look forward to seeing many more. I'm also pleased to know that many British schools, universities, and other educational institutions have been welcomed in Gutter, including University College London, which will soon establish a campus in Doha. Cultural and sporting ties also are thriving, and I am encouraged by the new links being developed between British institutions and Gutter, including the British Library, Tate, the Royal Society, and our respective Olympic committees. And in April this year, we were glad that Sheikh Moza came here to Windsor Castle for the inauguration of the new joint venture between the Gutta Foundation and Bloomsbury Publishing. It is a pleasure to have this opportunity to pay tribute to the efforts by you and the government of Gutta to help resolve regional conflicts in Lebanon, Darfur, and Yemen. You have a particular ability to bring people together to reach consensus on difficult issues. I welcome the fact that we continue to work together on these issues. I'm delighted to know you will be visiting the Royal Military Academy at Sandhurst. As you will recollect, the motto of the Academy is serve to lead. I believe that these words fittingly describe your own approach to the responsibilities of leadership, the promotion of peace, the encouragement of education and culture, and your far-sighted and enlightened plans for the future of your country as an open and tolerant society. This visit is a chance for us to celebrate the breadth and depth of our partnership. I'm confident that in the years to come, it will bring significant social, economic, and political benefits to both our countries. Your Highness, Gata is known for the welcome it provides to visitors. I hope that your reception in this country will demonstrate that the United Kingdom is equally hospitable. As old and valued friends, you are particularly welcome. I very much hope that you, your family, and all the people of Gutter will always look upon the United Kingdom as a home from home. Ladies and gentlemen, I invite you all to rise and drink a toast to His Highness Sheikh Hamad, Her Highness Sheikh Hamosa, and the people of the state of Gutter.
صاحبة الجلالة صاحب السمو الملكي الأمير فيليب دو قدمبرا صاحب السمو الملكي الأمير تشارلز أمير ويلز أصحاب السمو والسعادة السيدات والسادة إنني وقرينتي الشيخة موزة نشعر بامتنان وعرفان شديد أن جاءت دعوتكم لنا اليوم في وينسور التي نعلم أنها ملتقى الأسرة المالكة البريطانية ومجمع عمرائها ونعلم أنها بيتكم الحميم وذلك يشعرنا بأواصر من الصداقة والألفة نعتز بها من صميم قلوبنا والحقيقة أن وينسور ليست فقط بيتا لكم وإنما هي قلعة للتاريخ وللحضارة تحرصون عليها وما زلنا نذكر وقفة جلالتكم يوم الحريق وحرصكم الوفي على عودتها كما كانت وأفضل إننا نعلم صاحبة الجلالة أهمية المسؤولية التي نهضت بها الأسرة المالكة في حياة الأمة البريطانية وفي تطور الإمبراطورية في ظروف تحول في ظروف تحول ضخم جرى سلسا وبنا في وفي ظروف تحولات دولية بعيدة المدى والأثر وإنه لا يسعدنا أن يكون هذا اللقاء في وينسور تحية لعلاقات صداقة ومودة ربطت بينكم وبيننا نتمنى لكم كل السعادة والرفعة وشكرا لكم